everyone, my name is Megan Cortez with Bernstein Realty, creating a video tour of this home today, 13510 Douglas Lake Road in Water's Edge. This home is listed at $335,000. Let's go take a look inside. So, lush landscaping in the front of this home, as well as a covered patio. And what's great about this home is that the utility easement is in the front and not the back of the home. Also has full coverage sprinkler system. Entering into the front of the home, we'll walk into the foyer. And to the left is the formal dining and living space with arched openings and wood hardwood floors. Entering into the home is the curved staircase that features iron spindles and a custom oak banister. So next we'll head into the kitchen, which features these mocha, dark mocha stained cabinets, stainless steel appliances, and a custom vent. A gas range oven, a little breakfast bar, area, granite countertops, and mosaic backsplash, working space, uses an appliance bar, and pantry. Right off the kitchen is a spacious breakfast room with large windows and plenty of natural light. And next to the kitchen and breakfast area is this two-story den, the gas log, wood-burning fireplace. And this continues into the master suite. Master Suite features hardwood floors and bay windows for great views of the backyard. The master bath is like a spa retreat with large vanities, mosaic tile accents, and granite. As soon as you get to the top of the stairs, you walk into the game room area with a large walk-in closet. And this leads into the media room. So you can close these doors off. It's wired for surround sound. And it has space for a large TV. Right off the game room is a bathroom and a front bedroom. Large window that faces the front of the home and a walk-in closet. Next is the upstairs third and fourth bedrooms that share a bathroom. The bedroom to the front. And this room has a hidden bookshelf. That is a closet.
go back downstairs. Underneath the stairs is a closet. This leads into the utility room, which leads into a three car garage. And then the downstairs have bath. So here's the backyard of this home, a large backyard. Again, utility easements are in the front of the home and not in the back. And you have a covered patio with ceiling fans. This home was built in 2014. If you'd like to learn more, please reach out to me and I'd love to share more.